breaking within the last hour. We also learned a Jacksonville City Councilman is one of those cases. He tested positive for coronavirus. Sam Newby is being treated at St. Vincent. Another councilman visited Newby at the hospital, Councilman Randy White. And now White is self-isolating himself. If you get news for Jack's push alerts, you probably saw this on your phone. If you open it up, you'll find comments from Mayor Lenny Curry on this news. So here's a quick look at the 14 local cases. Four are in Duval County, three in Clay, three in Alachua, two in St. John's, one in Nassau, and one in Charlton. We have multiple crews covering coronavirus. We begin with Jim Piggott joining us by phone. Jim, you spoke with Councilman Newby. How's he doing? Well, he sounded fine on the phone when I was talking to him an hour ago. I called him around 9 o'clock when I had heard what was happening and right before the mayor had confirmed all of this. And Newby just said that, hey, I'm in the hospital, I'm in isolation, but I'm doing okay. And he said he just wants people to pray for him at the time. He didn't want to talk a long time. He didn't want us to record the conversation or anything of that nature. But he did sound like, he didn't sound like somebody uh, that was sick. But he also said that he had been sick for some time, that uh, uh, since March 3rd, for another illness. And that's why he hasn't been around at that point. But he said that that's why he was at the hospital. He tested positive yesterday, and then he wanted to let everyone know. He wrote a letter to the city council president informing him of what had happened, and that was his main concern. just wanted to get this out there. But when I talked to him, he sounded fine on the phone. And again, he just wants people to pray for him and to pray for others. And Jim, council members are around the public all the time. When was the last time Newby was around people? Well, we know that he's been stuck since March 3rd. He wasn't at the last city council meeting last week, so that's being determined at this point. And, you know, there's a special city council meeting set for tomorrow just to talk about the coronavirus emergency, and that's set for 1130 tomorrow. They're going to take up one other issue as well. But there's some concern about that as well, and I'm sure throughout the evening and the early morning hours, we're going to find out more if that meeting is going to take place. Many city council members weren't aware of Newby's condition, he sent that letter to the council president, I think it was around 5 o'clock this evening, so many are finding out at this point. Again, that's Jim Pickett reporting live by phone about this update with the council person, Sam Newby, who has tested positive for COVID-19. Thank you, Jim.